Desmond, congratulations on making your first qualifier into the Vacation Land Cup. It seems like you've had a really good entrance into Limitless Wrestling, first defeating Brad Cashew, uh, that undefeated streak that we were just hoping someone would break. And now today, you didn't even know who your opponent was, and you wound up defeating Aaron Borg. Now, next stop, Vacation Land. What are your thoughts on that opportunity, and how that could affect your Limitless trajectory? Well, not only a Limitless trajectory, but this is like career pivoting for me. You have no idea, Sam. You're right, I didn't know what was going on coming into this. But I, I'm speechless, I'm, I'm emotional. I, uh, ever since this Vacation Land Cup was announced, I said, I'm gonna get there no matter what it takes. I'm gonna get there. And I did it, no matter what the odds were tonight. No matter if it was J.D. Drake, unfortunately, Aaron Work, I did it. And now all I am focused on is the next step. Because I am coming to win the Vacation Land Cup because I am officially in it. Well, best of luck, Desmond. Thank you so much. I'll see you there. Thank you. Sam Laternick here. I'm hoping to catch a word with Art following two consecutive losses tonight. Hello? What? Can I, can I have a word with you guys? What? What? Two, what? Cons two consecutive losses tonight. Is, is Ricky going to be the one to pull out the victory? You want to ask me a question? I'll answer your question. Yeah, yeah. come on out. Yeah, what's up? So, Ricky, Art is 2-0 and oh here. You are the final chance for Art tonight. You go head-to-head -head with Mojavari. What are your thoughts about this match? I think... I think well, guys! Don't, don't you talk to him, Ricky! Don't talk to him! Brad, is it possible to have a word with you following your return to Limitless Wrestling? Whatever, sure. I know I've never interviewed you before, but it's been three years since you were here at Limitless Wrestling. Tonight you returned in a six-man scramble. You didn't come up victorious, but how does it feel being back at Limitless Wrestling? This morning when I got the call to come here, it felt great. Right now, it doesn't feel so. It doesn't feel great. It doesn't feel great. Three years on the shelf, and I watch this company rise. I watch this company become something great. Why, I stayed stagnant. I stayed at a level, and I don't stay at levels. I grow levels. I get higher. I keep growing. And now, to come back to Alasha sucks. It sucks. I put in all this work. I put in all this time. And to come back and to come up short absolutely sucks. But it's not the last time I'll be here. It's not the last time I'll be here. I got denied before. Hell, I'll get denied again. But after a while, y'all can't deny me anymore. I'm Big Bacon, and I'm the most talented wrestler from this area. And it's about time everyone gets put on notice. Oh, Materius, come on, come on. Dango, Dango, Dango. Can I get a word? You're filming right now. You going to film me? Yes. OK, yeah, what, what, what? Yeah. what? It, it seems like uh, communication, per se, might have broken down with you and, you and MSP there. So uh, what are your thoughts? Following communication. I mean, I come here every other month to come work for my local hometown independent company to try to do them a favor, to try to get them a fucking crowd here. And I got a team with a clown and another clown, two clowns. I just left New York playing the jester, okay, with another clown. I'm not coming back to my local hometown independent company to be a fucking jester again, okay? And I'm, I'm tired of jesters costing me matches, okay? Next time, ask me to interview me before you just throw a camera in my face, paparazzi style, okay? I'm so sorry. Right, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I didn't mean right. to. Oh. Uh, night, isn't this incredible? Look, like you guys have been telling me, like, I just need more to prove myself that I've been sucking and losing and all that. And I finally did it. I won. I even got my winner's purse for the first time. Isn't that awesome? I'm so happy. Why aren't you guys happy? Why are you look sad? What? Like, congratulations, Rick, but where were you for us tonight? I was there. I was with you guys. Like, we gave you a guaranteed win. Where were you for us? You think you proved you're a member of art? 